but if we are in front of a technology or a device or something that is non-explainable, uh, sometimes the solution that people come up is that, okay, so let me, uh, let me have access to the source code or something like that. Normally, that, that will not work. Even if you have access to the source code, even if you have access to the algorithm, normally you cannot understand. If we go to uh, methodologies, uh, machine learn wise, widespread, that will not function. And I guess we can come up with uh, what sometimes people call a counterfactual explanation. Then you, you can, uh, in order, and here, I guess it is a little bit uh, useful for, for this, that uh, to make a difference between transparency obligations and explanation obligations, expo, ex, ex ante, ex post obligation. So when we are talking about ex ante obligations, we are talking about transparency in order to say what data is used, what is the input, we can have the output and so forth. Uh, and this is, uh, this is one instrument of accountability that we can have. When you're talking about ex post, obligations that we can talk about explanations as one of that we are also talking about accountability measures so in a way uh, right uh, as a right explanation even on non-explainable uh, seasons will function not only for the data subject to challenge that particular decision but also to uh, to provide the regulator to the enforcement authority enough uh, information or enough uh, Comprehensib com comprehensibility of the system that if it to check if it follows all of the compliance obligations that there is.